brought you guys to one of my favorite morning stop spots. It's got to be the most relaxing spot on my route, on, on any of the routes that I take. And today I wanted to really talk about five things that you really should almost have even before you purchase a wheel. Oh, that was a terrible throw right there. Hey, look at this guy. Hey, guy. You want one of those? You want one? There you go. Try yeah. these guys, try these ducks around here work. You done eating that one over here? This guy here, he's a smart guy, see? He's gonna come around Big Papa himself. Come on. There you go. There you go. There you go. He's like, why go in the water? I'll just come up to you. I see the rest of the family. They getting wind that something is going on. You see him over there walking. They getting wind that somebody is eating somewhere. There you go. See? That's how you do it. Come to the source yourself. So back to what we were talking about. Five things that you should have in purchasing an EUC wheel. Five things that you definitely should have. One, first and foremost, before you even buy a wheel, you should have invested and protective gear. Protective gear is a must. Helmet, shoulder pads, back pads, elbow pads, knee pads, shin pads, wrist pads, wrist, wrist protection. Along with protective gear, we're going to put um, mirrors, mirrors that allow you to see what's behind you. You're not trying to read plates, but you definitely are trying to see anything that might be behind you. The second most important thing um, that you most definitely want to make sure you invest in are some flat sole shoes with maybe some Dr. Scholl paddings or some type of padding because your feet are going to be an issue. First riding a uh, unicycle. So you want to make sure you have some type of, um, you know, Dr. Show flat sole shoes, Dr. Show type of a padding. I use Dr. Show's and extra, you know, uh, generic type padding, and it works pretty well. Number four, a kickstand. Whatever wheel you're interested in buying. I recommend you have the kickstand before you purchase the wheel. Trust and believe me, you'll save yourself a lot of heartaches. A kickstand is very important as you look for the wheel you desire to ride. Also look for the kickstand. Can I get a drum roll for the fifth thing you should buy if you buy an electric unicycle? Don't allow this moment to slip away without you capturing you learning how to ride an electric unicycle. You're going to regret it if you do. I highly recommend you invest in some type of camera. Even if you can't afford a GoPro camera, invest in some type of camera as you learn how to ride this monster of a machine because you're going to want to go back and look at those epic moments especially when you're doing you know speeds of 30 and 40 once you get up there and your skills are, are good you're going to want to see how your journey went so i advise you 
invest in a camera. Well, with that said, remember to always keep it real and have a real-tastic day.